Yo! Okay, back with the Whiteboard of Truth today. Um, a subject that, again, I don't think is discussed nearly as much as it should be in the fitness industry. Again, not the most sexy of subjects. Maybe I'll call myself the unsexy trainer. Maybe there's a remarketing thing there. Um, and that is exercise and mental health. So I think it's easy to get caught up in the messaging that exercise is only there for fat loss or getting a hench. Now, it's important to remember, very important to remember, that exercise is not just for fat loss. Three exclamation points. That's how strongly I feel. Now, I think there's a real onus, a real responsibility on people such as myself who are selling you these fat loss programs to also balance out the messaging with the fact that exercise will have profound beneficial effects on mental health, basically. Because in my head, that's far more important than just losing a couple of kilos or a couple of centimeters. So exercise will have, can I use, can I use the same word, a profound positive effect on a number of mental health disorders. And again, there's a, there's a large proportion of the population suffering and dealing with these mental health disorders that maybe aren't aware of the beneficial effects that exercise can have on said disorders. So exercise has a positive effect on stress, depression, anxiety, schizophrenia. Again, I'm not saying it's gonna cure these conditions instantly, of course it's not, but it's proven, it's science, that exercise will have a beneficial effect on the symptoms of said disorders. And again, it's not a message, it's not something that's said enough, but it is so, so important. So not only that, not only the mental health disorders, but generally exercise will improve self-efficacy. So uh, self-worth, self-belief, uh, increase self-esteem, so just feeling better about yourself generally. Improve sleep and the knock-on beneficial effects of improved sleep. Increase libido, who doesn't want that? Uh, just a general distraction from the stresses and strains of life, having a bad day at work, going for a run, going to the gym, doing some squats. It's a distraction uh, from the stresses and strains. And just generally an improved mood. Who doesn't want that? So again, I'll say it again. There's a real responsibility on people such as myself to remind you that exercise is not just for fat loss. So get active, stay active, spread the good word. Hope that helps.